Internet businesses have huge profit margins and little to no maintenance. So why isn't everyone doing it? Well, most people are, and that means that it can be extremely difficult to successfully start a profitable internet business with all of the competition that's already online. Today, I will show you a platform that allows you to buy and sell profitable online businesses that are vetted by the website. Now, before I get into this video, I do want to say that I'm in no way affiliated with any of the websites I show in this video. I personally found these websites on my own time and decided that they would provide value to you all. I would also like to say that there is risk to any investment you make online. Even though these websites do actively make profit currently, that doesn't mean that they can't fail down the line. And so there is always risk of you losing money no matter what investment you make, especially on this website, which I will talk about in this video. So what is Empire Flippers and what do they offer? They do offer services for buying and selling online businesses that are currently profitable and that currently have cash flow. So what differentiates them from other websites that offer similar services such as Flippa and other marketplaces for buying and selling websites? What Empire Flippers does is that they fully vet everything themselves. They manually check that every single website that requests to be sold on Empire Flippers is legitimate and that they actually have cash flow. So instead of some other sites where you can just put any amount of money that you're making per month, so you can say, I'm making $5,000 a month, but in reality, maybe you're not, maybe you're lying, you're just trying to scam someone. What Empire Flippers does is they require that they vet everything. So anything that you say, they have to log into that account and make sure it's legitimate before they even consider listing your website on Empire Flippers. And then they also consider the quality of the business. So if your business is not legitimately profitable or if it's going to fail very, very fast, then that makes it less likely that they are going to list your website. So what type of websites are listed on Empire Flippers and how can you take advantage of this? So there are websites ranging all the way from AdSense, Affiliate, Amazon Associates, Amazon FBA, e-commerce, and SAAS, as well as other types of websites being sold on Empire Flippers. So here you can see a website that is $3 million. So obviously that is quite expensive. However, they do have quite a range of websites on Empire Flippers. As you can see here, their current cheapest website is $40,000. And as I showed before, it does go all the way up to millions and millions of dollars. So that would all depend on your budget and what you're looking to risk. However, when looking at these websites, it's really important to realize that as is with everything else, the more you spend, the more likely it is to be a higher quality business. Obviously, a lot of these larger businesses have already established themselves much, much more and tend to have much more stable profit. So that's what makes these more expensive businesses much more appealing. So even though you might say, well, I only have $40,000 in my bank account right now to buy a business, it still might be a good idea to save up a little bit more and really wait for the right business to show up or even save a little bit more to get a little bit higher quality business because a lot of these smaller businesses that are being sold on Empire Flippers are still in their early stages of growth and that means that there is still higher risk. So why is Empire Flippers so great in my opinion and why was I so happy to find this website? Well, because I wanted to diversify my portfolio. Obviously, I'm very, very heavily in trading and I make a lot of my income on a day-to-day -day basis and having something like a website that would allow me to earn much more passive income that I can grow on the side would definitely be something that was very interesting to me. And so what I saw as valuable on this website is not only can you obviously look to buy a website and that is the main purpose of this website, but you can also see what a lot of these websites do and get inspiration in order to start your own online businesses. So just as an example here, if I wanted to start an e-commerce business in the home niche, I think Empire Flippers would be a great resource to look at because what they provide is they provide a detailed description of the business so you can get some ideas from that. However, what they also provide with a lot of businesses is seller interviews where basically where they go on a call with the seller of these already successful websites that can range all the way from six figures to even seven figures and they get on a call with these people who started these businesses where they basically tell you a little bit about how they started their business and I find it very very valuable when looking for different ideas to start your own online business 
to listen to some of these interviews because all of these people has, have already successfully started their own businesses. So it can give you a huge advantage instead of just going into this completely without any experience. So that's what I found to be very, very valuable. A lot of what they provide on their website with descriptions of businesses, interviews are very, very valuable even if you don't wanna buy a website. However, obviously if you do want to buy a website, I find that to be valuable because a lot of the time the hardest thing is finding a profitable idea. Whenever you're starting an online business, the hardest part isn't actually starting it, it's finding that initial profitable idea. Then obviously you have to execute it successfully, but this basically cuts out some of the hardest parts of starting a business. Here you have people who have already made a profitable business, so now all you have to do is go in and then try to grow it to grow your income and make sure that it stays stable. So although it does sound good, there are still some risks. Obviously, if your business does fail, then you can lose all of the money that you initially invested into it. And those risks that range from these websites tend to be around whatever monetization source it uses. So for example, if I were to buy an Amazon FBA business, then a major risk is that Amazon changes some of their terms of service and then makes it where the product that I'm selling is no longer Amazon recommended. And my company would probably make a lot less sales and therefore make less profit. So there's a lot of different risks you have to look at and you really have to think about that when looking at what business you're looking to buy. Now, that being said, the reason that these websites are so popular is because a lot of investment firms have been buying these websites in order to diversify their portfolios. So what they do is they look for profitable, stable websites, and then they will buy it and then just hire someone to run it for their firm. Now, of course, something that is a very hot term is how fast can I make my money back? So this can be a very complicated answer because there are a lot of different factors and different things you have to consider in terms of your return on your investment. So Empire Flippers takes a 15% fee whenever you sell your website. So if I were to sell a $40,000 website, then they would take 15% of that. So the buyer doesn't pay any fees, but the, but the seller does pay fees. So how long would it... So if I bought a business for $40,000, how long would it take me to make that 15% fee back that they take from the seller? So if I wanted to buy this website and then sell it once again on Empire Flippers, how long would it take me to get that 15% back? So on average, most businesses on Empire Flippers, just on their current monthly income, take around 30 to 24 months in order to make your full investment back. And obviously that's assuming that you don't grow the business at all. So the most important factor when, look, when looking to purchase a business is can I grow this to expand my income to make my return faster? However, there are other models that you can make as well. So if you do buy a business that has a 30 day return, then it will take four and a half months in order to get that 15% back. And if you buy a business with a 24 month return or two year return on your investment, then it would take approximately 3.6 months to get that 15% fee back. So if you bought one of these businesses and then decided, okay, after three and a half months, I want to sell this again because I actually don't like it, then it would only take you three and a half months to make that to make those fees back from the initial sale of the business. So how can you make money off this website? So there are a lot of different ways that you can make money off this. You can either sell your current business on this website. One thing that some people do is that they do start multiple businesses at the same time. And then whichever businesses become successful, instead of growing it, they just go ahead and sell it on Empire Flippers. So that's one thing you can do. You can grow businesses and sell them, or you can buy smaller businesses such as the businesses in the $80,000 to $100,000 range, and then grow it into a multiple six figure business or even a seven figure business and then once again sell it on empire flippers or just keep it as your own income there are honestly so many different ways that you can take advantage of empire flippers and i was super excited whenever i first heard about it because i personally had never even heard of anything like this thank you guys so much for watching and see you guys in the next one mm -hmm.